Look at her doing push-ups to try and win over Joey. No. You can have him after I've had his baby. Hi guys and welcome back to another episode of Sims 4 50 Baby Challenge. We are back with Maddie, Luna and Jacob and Maddie is very pregnant at the moment and should be having a baby very 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 soon I am hoping. She's in her third trimester and she's massive and I mean massive like to a stage where it's like girl you gone pop like you may want to get her checked out you're very very big. So hopefully she will have a baby soon. Well, I mean, what else would she have? Like a dog? Like, hopefully a baby. And once she has the baby, we will be able to name it and then meet another man because we now have a good living conditions. Um, the kids are doing well. It's 10 p.m. on a Thursday and Luna is deciding to play some violin, which is actually going to go to sleep now, Luna. Sleep. Don't just leave your file in the middle of the room. Goodness sake. So what do you want to do? You want to compliment someone, buy a puppet theatre, and finish a painting. So we can go and do the finish a painting. Um, let's do a large classic painting. Go and do that. I guess one of your aspirations up. We're not doing the other. We're not buying a puppet theatre. So I can go away. Um, buy a toy. Oh, we can buy toys. Oh, we didn't have a robot. Oh, oh my goodness, these toys are expensive. Holy heck. Um, let's buy <gasps> Waffle Cone, the Llama, Unicorn, Talking Toy. Heck yeah. Why would we not want a talking unicorn? <laughs> and we're going to add the unicorn to the toy box. And where are you off to? No, don't think you can just go to, like, get up and early on a Friday and do that. You need to go and experiment, I think. What does mum want to do? Mum wants to play Don't Wake the Unicorn. She wants to meet someone new and she wants to paint a landscape painting. Um, go and sell that. Go and clean up game. It does, okay. She wants to admire herself in the mirror. Oh, we need to go and throw that away and then admire self. Go and do those. Okay, you can stop practicing. She's uncomfortable because it was messy in there. He needs, to, he's not going to have time to eat. It'll just be school. So just go straight to school. Both of you are off to school where you're both going to work hard and study hard. Is there anything you want to buy an instrument? I can do that. I'm just trying to do any to make it so that she can like get up her learning. No, her sim points so that she can have the thing that makes her more like likely to have twins and triplets. You also need to clean up like this is messy. Oh, spelling bee aid. It's the first school spelling bee and Jacob has made it to the final round, but this time he's never even heard of the word he's supposed to spell. Glancing around the room, Jacob sees a class brainiac flash him her notebook with a word written neatly on it. Should he accept it or give it his best guess? Give it his best shot. Smart move. Jacob knows not to trust hyper-competitive smart kids. He closes his eyes, blocks out the notebook and guesses each letter slowly. Correct. Jacob is a surprise winner. Yay, Jacob. Don't trust those snotty up themselves kids because they're trying to throw you under the bus. Oh no. Luna's sitting next to new kid at lunch when she spies something pink in his lunch bag. Is that a bib? The kid smells nervously and claims that he's got his baby sister's lunch again. Then the bib falls out where everyone can see it. Pick it up and ign or ignore it. Pick it up. Luna places her shoe over the bib and grabs it when she thinks no one is looking. Unfortunately class Billy is looking and immediately starts calling her a little baby. Little help here new kid. No. Well Luna you did the right thing. You can be angry because you got caught with it, but you did the right thing. Just keep that in mind. It's fine. Let's make some new friends because you did the right thing. She does like have the baby already. Like she is my house of Luna met Hayden while at school. Who's Hayden, Luna? Um, 
Who's this? Hayden? Oh, that's Hayden. Yeah, you better just be acquaintances. You're far too young for a boyfriend. She's finished a masterpiece? Heck yeah. Sail it. Bring in all the moolah. Yes, we do want to sail it. And then you need to pee. And then you need to like eat and you need to do a lot of things. Clean out spoiled food. And then clean up that as well. Cook a gourmet meal. Oh. Let's make Capri salad in a party size. Because we have like us, we have the kids, we have the occasional man over. We really need to like have a way to serve everyone gourmet meals. Is this because she's got like quite a good cooking level now? Must be. And that was an easy one to do. Perfect. We kind of need like the kid. There we go. It was like we need the kids to come home so that she can. She's just going to be angry. She's going to yell at. Oh, she ran in to yell at him. Poor Uni. He did not do anything. She's going to troll to forums. Right. We know what type of person she's going to be when she's a teen. <laughs> go and grab some food. Did the TV break? Oh no it didn't, I thought it broke, I was like, hey. Um, then we need to like, tell an unbelievable story, and then lecture about misbehaviour, express admiration. That's when you're like, you are bad and you should feel bad, but it's because, I'm saying this because I love you. The other thing you need to do is you need to go and like, practice pick up lines. And then you can go to sleep, or at least go and take a nap. Practice pickup lines. Oh, she's gone into labour. Um, let's have baby. She requires an empty bassinet. So we can't do that. Do we have any bassinets? Let's have a look. Do we have any in our family inventory? We don't. We have a trophy case, a slablet. And a desk name plate stolen. Well, we're going to put the slablet, whatever the heck that is, um, on there. Trophy cabinet can go there for all the trophies that we don't have, but I'm sure we'll get. And she's just going to need to go and have the baby at the hospital. Maddie, you need to get up and have baby at hospital. I'll just send her alone to have the baby. Go and have your child. I will protect the kids. She's having a baby. It's a boy. Yay. Okay. So the name that I'm going to pick from the comments is Austin. Austin Livingston. So there we go. We have another baby. There we go. She had baby. Where is she? Where's the baby? Is the baby upstairs? Where the hell is the baby? Um, go and mop and then go and sleep. I will find out where the child is. <laughs> Hello, child. The child is in Luna's room, which is not somewhere we're keeping it. <laughs> I don't think she would appreciate that. We'll put the baby up in mum's room. Because then, like as I said, the baby's basically an item. So at least if it's there, she can get to it when she needs to. She's going to go and sleep because she is exhausted. Jacob's having a look at the baby. Jacob, you could actually do some cleaning up if you would like. That would be great if you could like tidy. Help mum and all that jazz. And then Luna you're actually going to go and do your homework and so are you Jacob. Because if you do your homework now it means all weekend you can relax. That's what I used to do was do my homework on a Friday. Because then it meant for the rest of the weekend I didn't have to do it compared to when people were doing it on Sunday night before school and that was just like way I can relax on Sunday right before school haha -ha. 
And then gonna take a shower and sleep. Who's calling? Moira? No, Moira, we don't want to go to a party. I just had a baby. Okay, no, we don't. And then you need to change diaper, bounce, cuddle, bread. Oh, no, I meant breastfeed, not bottle feed. I don't really know what the difference is. Is there a difference? Does like anything different happen? There we go. Go to and then sleep. Because it is 10 pm. And she's lost the baby weight. Heck yeah. We're also just gonna try and like get you pregnant again. What do you want? Change dirty diaper again. Let's breastfeed again. Cuddle. And then we're going to sleep. Because it is late. And then we're going to open and have some of this cool salad. Okay, it's 6 a.m. What's everyone else doing? Jake's away to the toilet and then he's going to go and have some of this salad thing. I'd hate that. Like, can you imagine like having the same meal like your mum just made like lots of at once and then was like, right, that's breakfast, lunch and dinner sorted till it's done. I feel like there's someone out there whose parents are like that. Probably because they work a lot. Not judging. I would just not like it. Now we're going to bounce. We're going to cuddle. Make silly face. Rock. Talk. We just Malcolm just congratulated us on the new baby. Okay, you need to go and deal with the child. Change dirty diaper. I feel like this one poops a lot more than the other two did. I want to get this friendship up a wee bit more and then we're going to like age them up. And how long till the kids age up actually? Well she has a while, I'm not waiting 42 days for that. Mm -mm. Not today, not today. Luna and Jacob just became good friends, which is nice. We're going to age up because we're not dealing with a baby. Oh, okay, Austin can be the social butterfly and athletic, I think. Yeah, we're going to make him be the, what do you call it? No, athletic. We're going to make him be like the jock of the family. We also need to change whatever that is you're wearing because that's not the athletic one of the family. Go and change your appearance. We also need to make him a room, I just realised. Gonna need to do that too. Okay. So you're going to be like the athletic one of the family. Which means you need a cool haircut. That's a cool boy haircut. Or that. I like that one. Could do. Maybe that kid that was wearing like tank tops from a really young age and everyone's like, how? How do you, how, I can't wear tank tops and I'm 20, how can you do it now? Cute. So that's him sorted. He's going to be the sporty one of the family. Going to be on the football team, plays baseball and basketball. Going to be that kid. The jock. <laughs> so the first thing we're going to get you to do though is do your homework. Because I know you've just like grown up, but you've already been issued with homework. And then we're actually going to need to make him a room. Going to need to do that. See, we don't really have much room for expanding downstairs. But I think I can add flooring here. I'm pretty sure. Okay, so I now need to... <laughs> like replace that wall back um okay so this is austin's room i'm going to claim it like that's his bed um and i've moved the oh wait actually i need to move the computer around to here so we have austin's room and then we have like this is going to be another bathroom this is going to be like a study cubby 
and this is going to be the next kid's room don't know who the next kid is yet because she's not pregnant which we're going to fix so I don't actually think she knows any more guys that I'm thinking about it he's too old he's married already had a kid with him already had a kid with him yeah so we need to actually leave and go on an adventure so let's travel no with no one just ourselves we don't want to take the kids with us when we're like going on an adventure like <laughs> to find a new dad or another baby daddy don't want to take the kids for that one don't think it's the best suited environment for them to be honest oh there's Joey Graceffa, the winner of the season 2 YouTuber Hunger Games. Oh no. It's our ex. Um, we could have Joey. Let's have, let's have a friendly introduction with Joey. Joey, don't dance. Joey, don't do it. Actually, we're going to use the toilet first. No, don't. Go and use the toilet. No, go back down and use the toilet. And then you want to actually change outfit. No. Or can I just do that on you? Outfits. Change outfit. Let's go into our fancy dress. Cute. Let's go up and meet Joey. Um, friendly introduction with Joey Graceffa. Let's go and have Joey's baby. Yes, I know Joey's gay in real life, but in this, he's not. So, we are going to do this. Ask if he's single. If he's... Oh, no, wait. Joey has that ghost girlfriend, doesn't he? We'll find out in a minute. He's seeing someone. Oh. Are you, Joey? I didn't know this. Well, I mean, just because you're seeing someone doesn't mean that you can't see me. Oh no, ask about day, ask about day. Don't do that one, don't do that one. Um, Let's go... Go here. Let's go there and then can we call Joey to come down with us? Let's see if we can call him over. Sim's too far away to call over. Joey! Call him over. Joey. Joey, I want to have your babies. Great and date. Okay, I'm sorry. Smooth recovery. This is so awkward. Describe aesthetics. Heartfelt compliment. Ask about date. We just need to get him to light now a bit more. He's got his phone out. Okay, Joey. Okay. I love how I'm trying, like, Maddie at the moment is trying to woo him and he's still just dancing. Just dancing. Does not care. I don't care that I'm tired. We need to... Oh, come on. Stop losing it. We're losing it. Smooth recovery. I'm sorry. I am such a hoe. Why is the club DJ gone at 8pm? What type of nightclub is this? Ask to move in. Do you want to move in with me? Ask about D. No, we're not doing that. Compliment art? You're a piece of art. He doesn't seem to like me. Flirt. We're just going to keep trying. Eventually. Oh, he's liking it now. Look at her doing push-ups to try and win over Joey. No. You can have him after I've had his baby. I need to, like, keep throwing in flirting ones between other ones. Flirt, and then we're going to have... Oh, no, no, we're not going to have a first kiss. We're not. Abort. Abort. Right, we're going to need to talk to just all the guys. Um, gonna need to do it with all of them, just so we get their numbers. Except Clint, because or Cyrus rather, because we've already spoke to Cyrus. So as long as I am more than just 
friendly introduction because we're gonna go home now because it's late and then now means we have them all in our thing that we can now invite them over joey was just too hard for us unfortunately he was too difficult to get but we can hopefully get him in the future is what i'm hoping okay kids we are back and we are tired and we are going to sleep so what are the kids up to um luna why are the kids not like it's as though they didn't like go up in anything which is odd it also makes it awkward because it's gonna be like 3 a.m and none of them are tired i'm thinking once we have another kid we'll age up luna I think that's probably the best bet. Oh, I know what I didn't do. There are no lights upstairs. There we go. Much better. There were no lights. So she needs to sleep and then she needs to open and grab a serving of that. Okay. So it's Sunday. So I think on the Sunday we're going to invite over another man and try and get ourselves pregnant again because that's the point of the challenge we have three kids so far only another 47 to go hey how do you get friends with joey graceffa he's pretty cool <laughs> right sinus stop keeping tabs on who i'm dating it was a one night stand so it's going to be with all of them look at luna being straight as student can you do extra credit work you can and can you do extra credit work? You don't have homework for some reason. Don't know what happened to it. It's not there. Oh, I just realized we have $860. Oh. Let's quickly do some large classic paintings. <laughs> so you guys, I think I'm going to end this episode here. Next episode we will get pregnant with another man of some sorts. It will be great. We will have another child eventually, which will also be great. And yes, we have Maddie, Luna, who will be age up soon, Jacob and Austin. So we have Luna's going to be the smart one, Jacob's going to be the artistic one, and Austin's going to be the sporty one. Yeah, stereotypes. Let's go. So yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, remember to leave a like, comment down below with some more names and what I should do. Oh, thank you for the masterpiece. We need that extra money. Thank you. Remember to subscribe if you're new to the channel and we will see you all next time. Bye!